So just a quick FYI, as you guys see me styling this wig, you are going to see my edges peek through here and there. That's just because I have the wig literally sitting on top of my head and I'm not really trying to um, make it look nice and neat as of right now, but later on I am going to fix all of that. So I am aware that my real hair is showing underneath, okay you guys? <laughs> Okay, you guys, so this is how the hair ended up turning out. And I must say that I'm okay with how it turned out. I'm just not in, in love with how it turned out. It's okay. So first off, as you can see, this color is beautiful. The color is amazing. I really feel like this color complements my skin tone very, very well. But unfortunately, this hair does have some cons when it comes to this initial review. Um, for one, I feel like this hair is on the shorter side. I ordered an 18 inch and normally 18 inch does not fall on me this high up. It falls on me a tad bit lower. Um, did I measure the hair? No. <laughs> but I've been in the weave and wig game for a long time now. So I can pretty much look at a wig or a weave and tell if it's 18 inches, 16 inches. I can pretty much tell the length just by looking at it. And this is on the shorter side. So I'm not happy with that. Also, the density is definitely not up to par. This is all of the hair to the front. And I ordered 180% density. And I ordered 180% density. And I feel like this is not 180%. This is definitely on the thinner side. The purpose of me ordering a thicker density is to have thicker hair, to have more volume. I like wigs and weaves with volume that are voluptuous. And I just don't feel like this hair is giving me that. Had I known it would have been this thin, I would have ordered a 200% density. So I am not happy about that. So other than that, I'm not really, um, dissatisfied with anything else i do love 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 the color this is their body wave in the color light 99j and of course like i told you earlier it's in the it's supposed to be in 18 inches <laughs> um and they do have two 99j's on their site they have a light 99j and they have a dark 99j when it comes to the price i can't remember exactly how much i paid but i want to say it was around the 200 dollars mark i'm not exactly sure but I will have that down below in the description box telling you guys exactly how much I paid. Um, the texture on this wig is so silky, it's so pretty, it's so flowy. It's it's pretty hair. I just wish it was thicker, that's all. <laughs> so I think that's pretty much it when it comes to this hair. I will be giving you guys a one month update. If you're interested in that update, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below so you won't miss it. So like always, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And until next time, y'all. Bye.